Hey, Sheldon here. So I wanted to talk about leaving feedback as a seller on eBay. Now, feedback is a necessary part of the eBay ecosystem, and eBay gives us sellers a couple of tools under the new Seller Hub. Now, the first tool that eBay gives us to manage feedback is the automated feedback tool. And this can be configured to provide feedback automatically after a customer buys an item or after payment is made. And the big problem with this is it's only available on premium and anchor stores. So if you have a basic store, you don't get access to this tool. And I prefer not to use the automated feedback tool because sometimes a buyer will change their mind after paying for an item or sometimes after you ship the item to the buyer and they open it, they become a thorn in your side. They leave you negative feedback. They want to return the item, a whole host of problems. And I just prefer not to leave feedback until I'm pretty sure that they're happy with it. So that leaves us with the leave feedback tool. Now this tool is just awkward and time consuming. You've got to manually go through each one of your orders, choose how you want to rate it, and then enter in your comment and repeat this for every single item that you have to leave feedback for. And nobody has time for this, so don't use this. Now the method I like to use for doing feedback can be found underneath the orders box here. And you want to select shipped and waiting to give feedback. Now this shows me all my orders that are waiting to receive feedback. And the next thing I want to do is check off this box to, to toggle the check boxes for all these items. And if there's something I, somebody here I didn't want to leave feedback for, I could just uncheck them. Now underneath this other action, there is a leave feedback choice. So I want to select that. And now this shows me all the items that are queued up basically for feedback. And if I scroll down to the bottom of this, I can then choose from some various stored feedback options. And I just leave the same feedback for everybody. So I'm going to choose this one here. And then I just click this leave feedback button. So now at the top here, it says your feedbacks are being processed and will be left shortly. So there I just took care of leaving feedback on about 20 different items. And that process probably would take me normally about 20 to 30 seconds to complete. Now, I hope you find this method useful and thanks for watching.